we're coming up as far as uh, Shishan Village pretty soon. The Volcano Park is up here. We're going to do uh, a short um, photography challenge. So we're here in the Volcano Park. Uh, my Jake's first time here. I've been here before. We're going to have a quick photography competition, maybe about an hour, an hour and a half. Uh, three photographs each, and then we'll see, uh, you know, we'll put them in and see who's best. Yep. Let's go. I think it's okay. I'm never any good at taking people's, she doesn't like it, taking people's photos on their phone. Right, time to get my camera out. If I know Patrick, he'll be trying to take a photo of some bugs or butterflies or something like this. The competition's over. I think I got maybe two good shots, if I'm lucky. So we're in Sanqing village and we're in the chief of the village's house. Uh, his name is Mr. Wong. He, he speaks a little bit of English. So today what we're going to do is we're going to have roast beef and it's cooked on the local stone. And I can see here in front of me we have the tofu which is also uh, quite famous from this area. What they actually cook on here is volcanic rock and they said that the, it can withstand temperatures up as far as 1,300 degrees before it, it cracks and you know, locally they say that it's the best thing to actually cook your food on. It's ready to eat now and the way that you eat it is you take a little piece of pork, oh that's a big one, and you wrap it into the lettuce. Mm. That's really good. <laughs> Our village about 800 years ago, uh, Song Dynasty. People moved into this area about 2,000 years ago and his ancestors, um, they built this village probably about between eight and nine hundred years ago in the Song Dynasty. And this is a typical dish that would have taken back as far as then. It's really nice. Thank you. So we're here at the second of the ancient villages that we're going to visit today. This one's called Meiguan and I think here we're going to see uh, some pottery and we're going to go have a look at an old well. So yeah, let's get to it. A typical little shrine that you're going to see usually at, um, at gateways. Uh, they'll put um, oranges, uh, bits of fruit, maybe bowls of rice and they'll burn incense. It's a uh, Usually it's a, it's a shrine to the ancestors. I've seen some big pots in my day, but that is absolutely humongous. It's huge, it's without a doubt the biggest one I've ever seen. Um, we're just debating here what it was actually used for. We're looking at the carvings or um, the sculpture that's, up, that's actually on it. There is an ancient well down here to my left. We're gonna go down there in a few minutes and have a look. 
But on the picture here, uh, it looks like these people are, are, are pulling buckets up from the well and then they're moving over to the right-hand side, they're climbing up the stairs. We have heard that the locals here are saying that it's actually very difficult to drill a well in this area because with the volcanic uh, rock and soil, it's very porous and the groundwater is very, very deep. Um, that must be at least 100 feet and I can feel the cool breeze, a draft just coming up into my face. It's actually nice here. And we've just finished up now in uh, Meiguan village to visit the old well and uh, the pottery. So we're gonna drive around this area. We know this area pretty well. Uh, we've got an, a spot in mind where we're going to park the RV up for the night. And we're just in time because it's raining.